by Jupiter's Cock. Cheers and welcome, my friends. I'm Honor Truck and we are playing Domina. Um, in the last episode, we lost our champion, Spotnik the Small. Um, got uh, his head chopped off um, after a second in the pit. Um, should have been an, <laughs> an even fight, but um, he just died. Let's call it a freak accident and move on. I had to sell a couple of slaves. Uh, we also had a stroke of luck. We got Hannibal the Cannibal, a fugitive slave um, who arrived here. Really well kitted out. Um, so I kind of got to hope that I can train him up uh, to a certain point. We also have Suleiman the Fabulous, who is actually um, moving on with his training. I think um, we might work with him a little bit more because he already has a lot of strength um, and a fair amount of agility so I'm thinking that we maybe just move in that direction that might be that might be good just use him because he actually can sustain a little bit of damage and uh, yeah just upgrade upgrade his stuff um, as far as we as far as we can and uh, have him fight our battles. Um, the legate still likes us a little bit, um, so we could actually go and uh, go for an exhibition match over there. We could also suggest a uh, patronage. I'm not sure if he really would go for one. Um, but yeah, we're low in funds and we kind of lost our ability to actually gain new funds. Um, I'm actually thinking of selling albatross too um i mean he's been training up pretty well um it's got a bunch of levels over there it would be worth um a bit 65 it, i mean it's not that much but i really i don't want to i don't want to i want to keep my guys hmm. Hmm. it's crap we're gonna we're gonna see uh, what we do if i can actually dig myself out of there He's got defense level 8. I mean, I could just throw Albatross into a pit fight. See what we get. The problem is... We don't really see what they do beforehand. Um, how about an exhibition match? Defense 9, defense 15, 250, 209. I mean, that could be our thing here. If we... throw at, It's not really about the money only. Um, we really need to just get some XP on these guys. He only has defense level 2. He has defense level 6. He has defense level 13. I mean, having a Mamillo and a Thrakes fight together is a pretty good idea. We have two Mamillos right now. 3, 2, 43, 7. Yeah, I think Suleiman the Fabulous is actually the better dude for this. And then I guess we're going to put in Jordanius, who also has a fair amount of defense. We're going to get stuff back from here. Many of my gladiators versus many gladiators from another Ludus. They got 15 and 9. We got 13 and 6. Um, the agility is not very high on your Danius. 21. You've got 8 and 13. You've got 21 and 12. You've got 43 and 7 and 4 and 19. Um, we're going to try this. We're going to try this. What other choice do I have? I mean, we're not going to gain any money though from this. That's the real problem. Um, no, actually, I can't do that. Yeah, he's annoyed now. He, he organized the, the bloody thing, and now he's like, hey, stop. Stop having me organize stuff and then not do anything. Could go for the pole arm defense. That could be helpful. We haven't had that much pole arm. Hmm. Yeah, we don't really want to use the favors. While overseeing the training of your men, an arrow whisks past your face and sticks into a pillar. The arrow has a note attached. The note simply says, Cock. <laughs> Thank you. 
<laughs> okay, levels are going up. We gotta fight in the next battle. We gotta fight in the next battle and make some coin. Otherwise, we're just gonna look bad. Okay, he's, he now has Commander's Mail. I think we're just gonna kick out him. Um, because we don't really need him. He built everything that we wanted and we're gonna keep this stuff that he brings. I could bring in a bot, but I don't really have the money for anything there. So I'm just gonna leave it as is. Wait until we can have the next battle. Um, yeah, we're running out of food, which means I gotta buy some food. Yeah, it cost me three coins. We're really, <laughs> we're really bad off now. Losing our losing our champion like that. That is that is not great. Okay, already got four agility. Um, we're gonna go um, with the agility a little bit. I would like to see some additional hit points on your Danius as well. Meditate is no longer necessary. Suleiman, you're doing well. Mix a little bit more agility in there. Yeah, you already have a fair amount of HP, so. And Albatross, you could do with some agility there. Um, strength wise, you're actually fine now with 189, so I think we just leave that. He's doing defense training, weapon training, that's good. Just get a couple of levels on our guys and try to. I mean, time is ticking. It's not great. That is actually <laughs> it has a really bad knock-on effect. Oh, you got a two-hander now. That's interesting. We could um, downgrade that, gain those forty coins. I actually like the others better. I don't really like the two-handers that much. Yes, they're doing a lot more damage, but their attack speed is massively reduced. Um, this can sort of help us whittle enemies down. On the other hand, it's a fair amount of coin that they that, that is spent on that. Okay, another weapon level. We need to win some fights, though. Okay. Hannibal the Cannibal is getting upgrades. Okay, come on. Okay, one versus one. We got 10 defense. 202. He's got 21 agility, 12 attack. He's got the strength train speed. He has an insane amount of aggro. I think we're gonna go for Suleiman the Fabulous. I think you can do it, Suleiman. Or should we go for him? If I lose him, it's just gonna get wasted, all that equipment. Whereas on Suleiman the Fabulous, I'm actually gonna get the money back if we lose it, and then we can continue training up the others. So I guess it's gotta be it's gotta be you, Suleiman. I really hope that you do your best. You're not that you're not that bad off, right? I mean, he has uh, worse agility, he has worse attack level, he has two points more in defense, and he's gonna be a crazy aggressive guy. You have also um, 80 more hit points. So, come on, Suleiman, make me proud. Make a count, make a count, prepare for battle. Oh, he's chained! Oh, crap! I did not see that. Come on, kill him! You can do it, Suleiman! Yes! Yes! No, 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 no! Crap! Crap! Oh, I did not see that he was chained. Did I overlook that? I mean, yeah, we've got the equipment salvage and all, but... Crap! No! We lost a really good dude. Ah. Oh. I mean, we got the coin. I guess we can train up Hannibal. It was a much needed cash influx. And the Faber is now much more useful, of course. 
by, by chance, a vintner has accidentally delivered a cask of very expensive wine to your looters that was intended for your competitor. Um, thank you. Yay, free wine. The fact that it belongs to your competitor makes it taste even more sweet. Thanks for the wine. We're getting 55 wine. That's pretty nice. We're going to run out of food in a little bit. I going to run out of water. I'm not going to buy the wine. Oh, I guess I should. We need more money. Mm. I really would like him to get some experience under his belt. Because he's still green. No victories in the arena whatsoever. And we really need those victories. Uh, we also need to start winning championship games. I mean, Albatross is also looking really good. I guess I should just start equipping him. I'm going to mix a little bit of strength in there. I'm going to go for a little bit more HP training there. Okay. I mean, Jordanius is also starting to look pretty good. I still would like him to get a little bit more strength on. I mean, defense is important and all, but at least 200 HP would be would be pretty good. Come on. More strength training. 172. Okay, he's doing more defense training. Getting more strength on him. I'm going to stop at 200. Four more days until the next battle. Four more days. One of these guys has to fight. <clears throat> I'm gonna go for the pole arm defense here. Instead of having Dottora just stand around uselessly. Strength training. Yeah, we won't be able to finish these. Okay, we've got a roaming lion and three guys versus one of our guys. <laughs> 13, 6, and 6 in terms of defense. I mean, they have shit weapons, right? They have really bad weapons. Problem is that his evasion skill is pretty bad. And one versus three. That's just. <laughs> yeah, I mean, no. Just no. Thanks. One versus three is not a great idea. We still got the coin. We can train up, but. I'm unhappy with the, with the result. That was not planned. Um, I'm gonna go for deep breathing, which lets them recover um, HP during battle. That's pretty powerful. So let's do that. Problem with the strength training is that they train that instead of anything else, which is annoying. Um, your husband suffers from hemorrhoids. Why this is a problem for you, you don't fully understand, but he won't stop whining about it. Um, have a medicus make some anus ointment, I guess. <laughs> Using an ointment made from sharks, the bulbous hemorrhoids have been shrunk. Unfortunately, your husband still has the same protruding anus personality that he always did. <laughs> That's hilarious. And we've got no food. Gotta buy some food, otherwise people are gonna be mad. Yeah, I have a coin. have a coin. Oh yeah, we can award one of these guys the private room. Um, I think it's got to be Hannibal the Cannibal. Hmm. Yeah, it's got to be Hannibal the Cannibal. Your new champion then. Have the private room, my friend. I'm going to shuffle these guys around. We're going to try to build up Hannibal the Cannibal as our champion. That's yeah, how it has to be. Okay, now we can heal in the midst of battle. 
Throwing weapons, I actually don't really want to research that, because that is almost always a bad idea to throw your weapon, so... I really don't want that. Um, shield, we're not gonna really have that. Let's go for the net defense. The Ritiari are gonna annoy us at some point. Or Ritiarius. Come on, just reach 200 and then you can do other stuff again. Okay, 196. Taking a lot of time to train these guys up. It might actually be worth it to buy a slave from over here with a fair amount of um, stuff already. But the problem is that this guy is completely evasive. Which is not going to be useful. I mean, I guess he hates us, so he's not going to offer us the best stock either. Okay, weapon training. Got the net defense. Imp interpretive dance. <laughs> um, why not? Let's go for it. Okay, went close to um, 200 HP with Hannibal the Cannibal, so that's good. Um, so we got a four chain lions and a guy with a bad weapon. He has a max stamina increase. He's pretty evasive, pretty turtly. A um, little bit of aggro. He got a basic Puyo. So, yeah, stuff to beat other people. I make me proud, Hannibal. You got you got this. You can do it. I believe in you. We need the money. We need the money. <laughs> Calpurnius. <sighs> Come on. The problem is that the lions will try to get free of their chains. Come on, make it quick. Make it quick. Yes. Yes. That's how you do it. Nice one. Yes, and that's it. that is what we needed. Some much needed um, stats upgrades. Uh, people are thirsty, which is uh, I'm gonna make them mad. Let's buy some food as well. Got some money. Um, irritated. Come on, have some have some wine. Why is he so mad? All the people are irritated because they went hungry. I guess. Um, Hannibal the cannibal is healed. Um, Got 211 HP now. I'm gonna bring that down. Yeah, I think we're gonna go for a. Um, yeah, let's train his agility a little bit. The other guys are way more agile. Need more money. Okay, you got, we're gonna stop at 200. Um, yeah, strength training is gone. Um, let's go for the max stamina increase. Yeah, okay, people are happy again. Getting the defense level up. Agility is important. He's not very evasive, but oh well. A young, unmarked slave girl is found wandering on the road near your villa. Your guards bring her in and give her food and water. She speaks a foreign tongue. Word of the discovery gets out, and both the magistrate and legate demand that you turn her over. <laughs> Refuse to give up the girl, citing that the legate and magistrate are both notorious pedophiles. You surrender the girl to them over your dead body. <laughs> yes. Both men are outraged at the insult and swear vengeance. Yeah, yeah, come at me. <laughs> I mean, things are moving forward. You have very bad shoulder stuff. Although, no, you're actually waiting for the magical onyx thingy. I want to upgrade your helmet. Got the Onyx Mail, you got that one. I'm just gonna upgrade the Greaves, because that is just a waste of time upgrading those. So, you've got Agility 9, that's good. 
I'm a bit hesitant now to go for the pit fights, which I really shouldn't be. But what can I do? Yeah, this has definitely taken out the the speed of the series. <laughs> okay, so let's get let's go for more weapon and defense. And just mix those two. Um, and the HP are gonna come from winning fights. We still can we can still do this. We can still do this. Okay, he now got the best sword, which is really good. That saved us a lot of money, that, that Farba upgrade. Yeah, there is a lot of um I was just um, this is this is the, the winning strategy, just having a very few guys training them up. Um, and I wasn't going for that because I wanted to have as many of you guys in there with me as possible. So we got this guy, damage 25, defense level 5, agility 15. Four chain lines again. We're gonna send Hannibal in again, just to train up his strength and his confidence. Come on, you can you can kill this guy easily. I believe in you. I'm really sad that Suleiman is dead. Man, that was quick. <laughs> and for the kill. <laughs> Holy cow. Okay, and these are much needed strengths. He's gonna fix these things. Weapon training. Okay. Terrifying Beast Helmet is what we have now. Uh, that's actually the highest level of stuff. Very good. I really do appreciate that the Farber is always upgrading um, Hannibal. Oh, yeah, if you if you spread that out, if you have dozens of people training, then he's not going to be as useful as if you when you just have three or four of the guys. Okay, I've got the iron-plated shirt now. I'm going to get studded iron-plated shirt soonish. Yeah, these guys hate me. They just hate me. More defensive training. I think we've got to send him into a pit fight. We need more money. We need more slaves to train up. Okay. Several houses have fallen to a handful of disparate and small slave uprisings throughout the city. Magistrate is desperate for men to protect his household and the legate is desperate for men to guard the entrances to the city. Now I'm going to keep my guards at my villa. You watch as small groups of revolting slaves are run down by Roman legions swarming into the city. While the city escaped harm, the Magistrate and Legate are both equally upset. <laughs> Screw you then. Yeah, they are, they are um, sending me abuses. Something about me having to eat dirt and other stuff. That's fine. Actually... We do want the agility to be a little bit favored because he has a lot of weapon and defense levels already. He's also pretty good. I mean, just hesitant now to um, use my guys, which I really shouldn't be. We've got to move forward. After the next battle, we're going to go for pit fights again and try to boost um, the skills of Hannibal. And if you're Danius, I guess. Do not have any of Jupiter's favor. You have the defensive priority. Holy cow. What? One versus a group of opponents. They're really trying to kill me. And he's gonna be chained. Ah. <laughs> <sighs> <sighs> I mean, our guy is good, but is he that good? Is Hannibal the cannibal such a killer? I don't think so. And he's going to be chained as well. I mean, this could just be a slaughter. No, thank you. Yeah, well, he's mad that I didn't um, go for his attempt to actually kill my guy. Okay, Placidus. He's badly equipped. We're gonna we're gonna throw in Jordanius. Albatross is actually getting some pretty good gear by now as well. Jordanius is bad in terms of agility, but everything else is pretty good. Let's go and throw Jordanius in. Come on, 
You can do it, Jordanius. I believe in you. The other guy got more HP. Come on. Win this. Win this for me. Whoa, holy cow. Yes, we won it. Good. Good, 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 good. Nice. Salonus. And we got the Weapon Master. Uh, which is great. Because we can use the Weapon Master. All attacks do 35% more damage. On Hannibal the Cannibal. That's going to be amazing. We got Salonus. Are you any good? Hmm. Not really. I mean, AD aggro is pretty nice. Aggro and evasive. I guess he would make a decent Mermelo. So let's go meditate. Let's have you over here. And we'll see how things go. When is the next pit fight? Three days. Really got to go for something now. Um, I mean, I could also try to go for a championship. It's 18 days until the next battle. The problem is that we really need experience for our guys. Hmm... This guy, level 19. He's pretty good. It's not amazing. Max stamina. We've got the four chains. No, roaming lions! Holy frack. <laughs> <sighs> roaming lions. He really wants, wants to see me dead. I mean, he's going to do a crap ton of damage. He does 200 damage, which is with each strike. These guys have 135. So, it can kill one of these in one blow. I'm gonna try it. We need more XP. Come on, Hannibal. We need this. This could end badly. Nice! <laughs> Holy cow. <sighs> right. And another Weapon Master thing. I wonder if the Weapon Master actually affects um, if that gets applied doubly. I don't know. We could make him a fearsome damage dealer. Or we could actually boost one of the other guys as well. Maybe Albatross. Having three of them leveled up would actually be good. We need the champion. Um, come on. Where's the damage? Strength. Yeah. No, that's your HP. Where's the damage? Total. Temperament. He's a very heavy dude. 132 kilos. Doesn't tell me his damage. Pit fight in one days. Okay. The only bad thing that you have is your shield. Your shield is just horrible. Um, oh yeah, and that. That is fine. Could do with a better helmet. And upgrading these guys. That's also useful. So, Albatross is also going to be trained up to do something here. Um, your Danius trying to boost your agility. Hannibal, you're still hurt. Oh, yeah, we got another dude. Um, I have actually not been renaming Salonas of Creta. Uh, what's your name going to be? Um, okay. Crazy Superman. Have some wine and have a coin. And then just continue continue training, my friend. Um, we should, theoretically, we should actually buy someone. Oh yeah, that's actually uh, pretty nice. 80 aggro. 69 coin. Very ethos. We're gonna purchase that guy. Hello. Um... And you're gonna be Otto the Wild. 
Um, have some wine, have, have that. Um, he has a lot of aggro and a fair amount of evasive. That's going to make him a good mermillo. The problem is we really need more Thraxes. We only have one. We have a bunch of mermillos, but that's fine. That is the, the winning class in any case. Um, yeah, I don't really have money to to go for anything, but at least we're using all the all the training things. And he has already a high amount of um, meditation stuff. So yeah, I guess I'm just going to give you the very basic things. Something like this. Um, right, like this. So that we, tr so that we can use, um, make the most um, out of things. We need more money. Um, but I think we'll be able to send Hannibal into the pits again. Um, get ourselves some some money. We also really have to tackle the, the games now, the, the championships, otherwise uh, we're going to run out of time. Losing your champion um, that far in after 100 days is really bad, but um, I think we managed to crawl out of it pretty well. Hannibal is looking very promising, and the others are also pretty strong, so I'm happy with that. I'm actually going to switch these guys around, so Crazy Superman you're over here. Uh, I'm actually placing high hopes in Otto the Wild because he has 374 um, HP already, which means that I don't really have to train him up that heavily. Uh, he's also level 53 in agility, so all in all, uh, he really just needs weapon and defense training and some meditation, and he'll be good to go and, uh, yeah, wreck some face. But yeah, for now, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, please leave a like. If you didn't, tell me why in the comments so I can improve, and if you want to see more of the series in the future, please consider subscribing to the channel. I do hope that you join me next time. Thanks, and bye-bye.